it's Labor Day, but we're not working. We are going to Knott's Berry Farm for Koa Boy's birthday. Where is he? There he is. There's that kid. Feeling like fried chicken maybe later here at Knott's. Pretty sure we got the defective cashier. Now Christina's already smoking us and she just jumped in that line. <laughs> color out here 30 years no longer about 30 something years deadwood dick if you're still on our side by the end of the day i don't know what's going on if i go down i have no idea <laughs> <laughs> cool. Building stuff. Oh, I want to go in the stable. Let's go in the stable. Yeah, look, it's a horsey. Don't look him in the eyes. <laughs> You're gonna pet the horse. The climate control in this barn is great. <laughs> uh, you did? Yeah. I would ride on the donkey. Yeah. It's yeah. big enough. Yeah. You gotta give me a horse ride. I want a car like this. How's the headlights? How's the headlights? You light a candle and then it mirrors them out. Yeah. Robin, a slosh box is worse than a thieving hoss stealer. Any varmint caught in that be strung up without no trial. <laughs> wow, found some place in shade. Here at Knott's Berry Farm, it's um, getting hot. Oh, 
He's bubbling, boy. <laughs> you think you might be too big for that big guy? Come on. Oh. <laughs> oh, it's not too bad, huh? Beat right there. Beyond the beat with Brett Gate. I'm here at Huntington Beach on Tuesday, the day after Knott's Berry Farm. And let me tell you, that was quite a story. We we're having a great time. Uh, I was about to ride Pony Express for Esther Freaked Out. And when they got off the ride, the rest of the family, my nephew dropped his phone jumped over the fence to retrieve the phone. A fence just like this. Right by the raft ride. Came right back over. And within seconds, security said he had to leave the park. And he was banned for a year. At Security at Knott's Berry Farm, Miguel and Donald did not convey a message that they valued the guests. And we traveled from Vegas, rented a, that car, Stayed in a hotel, brought a tribe of people, eight of us, spent a bunch of money, got the all-day dining plan and everything. And we're not going to let my nephew sit in the car for six hours while we enjoy Knott's Berry Farm. So, of course, we all as a, a family had to leave. And honestly, I'm about to file a formal complaint so I can get a refund from my mother who came out of pocket for a lot of this trip. And I'm going to try to rectify this with the company directly but in the meantime, and in between time, I highly don't recommend anybody go to Knott's Berry Farm. Yes, it is a significant cheaper value than Disney, but however at Disney, they ensure that you have a, a great experience in every asset or in every aspect of the park. As with Knott's Berry Farm, from the moment we entered the park, bought food, rode rides, and our interaction with security was you could tell that there was a culture of negativity from the employers through the employees and onto the us, the guests. I'll try and give you an update on what follows in all this. We're just trying, I would like to recover like at least half of what we spent from my mother because if they went and they looked at the video or if we had any other witnesses, if anybody's seen what the reasoning for throwing us out, you would understand. But yeah. Thanks for watching. Please subscribe and don't ever go to Knott's Berry Farm.